guys, what is up? Split here, and today I'm finally back with another video. And in this video, we're gonna learn how to basically install mods onto Minecraft. So the first thing we need to do is download a program called Forge, which will basically simplify the mod installing process. So uh, just go to the website. The link is down below. Once you're here, the website should look something like this. And once you're here, you want to click on the installer by where it says recommended. So just click on that. And once you clicked on it, the download should pop up in a moment here. There we go. Just save it anywhere. And should download in a bit. There we go. It's finished downloading. Now let's now let's go to where we saved it. And you want to double click on it. Should open up. And once it's opened up, it should look like this. You want to make sure it's checked on install client and press OK. Then it should install Forge, so just wait for that. And once it's done, it should say successfully installed and press OK. And yeah, so if it says, if it has an error that comes up that says um, you need to at least run for uh, Minecraft version 1.7.2 just uh, just do this just go ahead and open up your Minecraft real quick once you have it opened up you want to go where it says version and you want to choose 1.7.2 there it is and go ahead and hit play and that's only if you're getting the error if you're not getting in any, any error when you're installing Forge just skip this part you don't have to worry about this part so anyways, I'm going to go ahead and exit out of Minecraft, but we'll be needing it pretty soon. But anyways, since now you have Forge successfully installed, we're going to go ahead and download our favorite mod. So in this video, I'm going to be using too many items. So if you want this mod as well, the link is down below as well. So once you're on the site, you want to go ahead and go down. And uh, I believe you click over here. Yep, you click over there where it says uh, 1.7. Point two forge. So just wait for that to come up. Alright, there we go. Go ahead and save it. I guess the same place you saved the other one. And save it there. Alright, now what we're gonna do is we're going to get the mod that you downloaded. Now before I do this, uh, it doesn't have to be too many items. Again, I'm just using this for the tutorial, but it does have to be Forge compatible. So therefore, any mod that you're trying to get has to be compatible with Forge. And I left a link down below as well um, to a website that takes you there. And basically on the website, it has every single mod that is compatible with Forge. But anyways, so once you got your mod, it should look like this. It's a .jar file. You want to just go on any folder, it doesn't matter which, I'm going to be using this. And once you're on any kind of folder, on the top, you want to just click on the address bar here and type in this, percent, app, data, percent, just like that. Hit enter, it should take you to this directory, you want to go into the .minecraft folder, which should be the top one in most cases, so just click on that. And once you're in here, uh, you don't want to mess with anything, but you want to look for your mods folder. Now, if you don't have a mods folder, just simply right click and go to new and make a folder called mods and basically just go in there. And once you're in here, you want to drop in the mod that you downloaded. So go ahead and drop it in like that. And then you want to close out of it. So let me just close out of it here. And then we're going to go ahead and start our Minecraft. So, yeah. Start up. All right. Once you're in, what do you want to do? Is you want to go to Edit Profile. It should be somewhere over here. And then you want to um, where it says Used Version. You want to select um, for uh, Release 1.7.2 slash Forge. That's what you want. So just click on that. Click on Save Profile and click Play. That's pretty much it. That's pretty much all you gotta do to get. The mods that you, uh, the mods working and should be installed. If you do get errors and stuff like that, please do leave it in the comment section below. I'll try my best to reply. And so yeah, so let's take a look at the mod we got. So yeah.
And uh, if you do get errors, um, it's probably because the mod you downloaded is not compatible again with Forge. So it's either not compatible with Forge or it's not 1.7.2. Now, if there is a future version of like if there's a higher version of Forge down uh, of Forge available in the future, say like 1.7.9 or uh, so on, then you can obviously download and that's what you will install. And uh, then you need to make sure that whatever you whatever mod that you um, downloaded is uh, one point seven point whatever or like whatever the version is and it's compatible with Forge. So now uh, yeah, so let me show you guys the mod in action. So there we go, we're in. Let me go into my inventory here. Chill load. And there we go. There we have too many items. It's a cool mod. Um, yeah, so that's all you gotta do to pretty much install mods. Now this is by doing it with Forge. So if you guys want a manual uh, tutorial on how to install mods like without Forge, that means uh, pretty much it's gonna be harder. But if you just uh, if you want that, just let me know. But yeah, anyway, so follow me on Twitter, you guys. Like the video if it helped. And uh, I did join a new YouTube network, and if you're interested in partnering your channel, the link is down below. And yeah, so that's pretty much it. So yeah, peace.